Hey everyone, welcome back to Everyday Rita. Today is another Pup Box unboxing. I am loving these Pup Box subscriptions. Super excited this one came in. This is for the month of April, so let's just go ahead and jump right into it. Not gonna talk too much. <laughs> so, first thing noticing when I first open the box is that there is a new section on the top here which has where you can put his favorites, his height, his weight, and then how old he is. I think that is super cute. So right now, Cornelius' favorite thing is treats. He is 10 and a half inches tall and he is 23 pounds. And he's six months, he's actually gonna be six months old in five days, six days. So technically he's still five months, but I just put six months because he's really close to six months. Okay, sorry this is a little bit wrinkled. I did take pictures already. Cornelius got a little crazy trying to get stuff in here. So some stuff might look a little chewed and folded. It's okay, it is what it is. We're just gonna jump into this. Let me go ahead and kind of fold this over. That's kind of what I did when I was taking photos. Just so nothing else is in the way. Okay, so first things first, you get this little card that says, my new look. And this says, hi puppy fam, a quick message from me, your friendly neighborhood pup box. Just wanted to point out that I have a new look with some fun interactive features for you and your fur baby. Fill in your pup's age and months, one of your pup's favorite things, and your pup's height and weight. The entire pup box pack wants to follow along as you grow. Make sure you pose with me for a quick selfie so you can post on Instagram, Facebook, stuff like that. So that's a new little card that comes with their new look. The next thing is this Spring Has Sprung card. So some information on this one. And time to clear the clutter. So like spring cleaning. The next one is the training card that they training and development card that they give with every box. So this one is for six month old puppy, which Cornelius will be six months in a few days. So it's perfect timing. And so just information on that and the back part, a guide to loose leash walking. We are slowly getting Cornelius. Um, we're not doing a lot of leash training, which we probably should, um, but we're actually training him more so to be even off the leash and next to us. So um, that's kind of what we're doing right now. But anyways, this will be a really good read because we do kind of need to do a little bit of leash training. So that is that. The next thing is just the what's inside. And then here is what's inside. I am really excited. So the first item is this Here Doggy Ultrasonic Toy. And... It says the ultrasonic toy only your dog can hear. So this is very interesting. I'm not too sure if it squeaks or what's the deal. It says try me. Uh, the silent squeaker only your dog can hear. So when we play with Cornelius like we do after each unboxing, we'll see and test it out and see how that works. And it's a little elephant so cute with this little furry tail. The next item is shampoo. So this is puppy shampoo with organic lavender oil, 100% natural and biodegradable. They kind of just taped it, you know, obviously, so it doesn't spill everywhere. Let me just, give me a second. So it's called Organic Oscar. Cute packaging. Um, looks like a bone. And it says extra mild, I don't know if my phone's going to pick, I mean my camera's going to pick this up. Extra mild shampoo designed to be safe and gentle for puppies' sensitive skin. Formulated with organic lavender, calm for puppies during baths. Leave skin most, um, sorry, moisturized and fur feeling soft and fluffy. Contains organic ingredients. So that is that. Nice size too, it is six fluid ounces. The next item is this little turtle which I think is really cute it says earth's friendly pet company three play turtle treat hiding squeak toy so I don't know what three play means does it mean because you can hide treats and it's a squeak toy what's the third thing I'm not too sure it does say um eco laugh and super float so it floats above water so that's kind of cool and this is how it looks on this side so the mouth part is not open which you know it kind of looks like it. But this part is open, so it kind of squeezes. You can push it down. So not too sure yet how this works. When we play with Cornelius, maybe we'll figure it out a little more. It, that is this one. So there you go, little turtle. That's cute. The next item is so fresh. Pick it up bag dispenser with refills. So doggy bags. And this one's cute. It's just a black one. 
We have one that's just green that we got from Amazon, but this one's cute. It's black with blue, my favorite color. I'm wearing a blue dress right now. <laughs> and that is that. So that's cute. Looks like that's the company, So Fresh. That's how the bags look. You can't have enough poop bags. Next item, I'm gonna leave that one for last. <laughs> the next one is these little Chewsies. And it says Chewy and Moist, the natural yummy choice. Emerald Pet, made with real turkey and real duck. Turkey is the first ingredient. Great for training dogs of all sizes. And look at here, low fat. He needs low fat. I'm just kidding. He's good, but he's a little fatty. Anyways, I don't even think my, oh, there you go, low fat. <clears throat> and I like the size of these. These do look really small, so I do like that. We're actually really low on some of his training treats, so this is like perfect timing. I don't have to buy any. And these are five calories per treat, which I believe the other ones I have are five or two calories per treat. I don't remember. Ingredients list looks pretty good, actually. I was kind of just reading it, so it actually looks pretty good. My camera is not going to focus into that small of a lettering. Sorry, you guys. If you're really interested in it, you can always uh, Google this company and look at the ingredients online. And lastly, I'm more excited about these because I think Robert's going to be more excited than anything than Cornelius. Uh, actually, they'll both be really excited. Cornelius loves these yaki sticks. I've gotten him... Um, I would say two or three bags already of these and they have all kinds of flavors. I've got him the cheese one, the chicken one, and I don't know, some other one. So this one is the fish meal, which Cornelius' favorite dog food is salmon. Like any like dog food that's flavored in fish or salmon is his favorite. So this is fish. So I know he's going to love it. And they're called churros. That's why I was going to say Robert's super happy. Robert's favorite thing ever is churros, whether we're at Costco and obviously at Disneyland. And so at first I thought it was churro flavor, and I was like, what the heck? But no, it's not churro flavor. I think it's the style of how it is. It looks like a churro, if you can tell. Because other yak sticks are just a circle cylinder. Um, so these ones are like churro looking. I think Cornelius is going to like this. I'm really excited for him to try it. And it looks like it says here, for all dogs, so puppies to adults. Lactose-free, gluten-free, and grain-free. Okay, so all these yaki sticks have these little chew meters on them, and it goes from like 0 to 10. I hope you can see this. So the first one says cookie, then bully is between like a 4 and a 2, and then antler, which is the highest, is a 10. So this one is at 2, so it's a little softer than a bully stick. So these are going to be a little on the soft side, which is good to have, and Cornelius does like a little bit of softer treats, so this is going to be nice. And that is that. And that is everything we got. As normal, I'm going to count how many products we got. So we got one and two treats. That's more than usual. Usually we only get one treat. So we got two treats. We got one little squeaky toy, or apparently the dog can only hear the squeaker. So ultrasonic or whatever this is called. <laughs> yeah, ultrasonic toy. This little um, food dispenser, floating water little turtle, which is super cute and um poop bags with the poop bag holder as well as a shampoo so that is a total of one two three four five six items which i believe our record is usually about six if i am not mistaken so as always pup box definitely keeps to their word on five to seven items and all really great sizes these treats are full size this is not a sample size because yaki sticks usually come in this size bag these little treats are totally standard size. It is five ounces. And then obviously the toys are just regular toys. You're getting two rolls of poop bags and a good size. This is more than a travel size. So a good size puppy shampoo. And that is that. So now I'm going to go ahead and play with Cornelius with all his new stuff. See how he likes these items. And we will see you with Cornelius. If he wakes up. Cornelius. Yeah, this is his current state right now. He does not care about pup box right now. Let's see if I squeak this thing, if he supposedly only hears it. Let's try this. Sorry, it's kind of dark where he is. He's like under a table. I'm squeaking it. Am I supposed to squeak? Where am I supposed to squeak? Oh wait, maybe he heard something. Robert's doing oh here. I feel I feel a little hard part. Oh, 
he hears something. This might work. Okay, he's up, so now we can play with him. Sorry, it's dark again. Let's go in a more lit area. Okay, Cornelius is so impatient, so we have to hurry. Because <laughs> he's been jumping. Okay, first thing is... What's like the first thing, babe? Turtle. Little turtle. Little turtle. Look at that, Corn. Is it supposed to have treats? So you can put treats in it, and it does squeak. His little head squeaks. Check it out. What is it? What do you think of it, Cornelius? It's rubber. As always, he has to acclimate himself with treats or toys. So, but he seems to like this one. Okay, next one. So this one, supposedly, he only hears and we don't. Does it smell weird? It smells. So, squeeze his head. Oh, I guess he hears it. Look at that. I mean, we just hear air, right? Is that all you hear? No, that's all I hear is air. Well, he looks excited. Look at it. Oh, he seems to like this one. Look at this. It's a little elephant, Cornelius. So that's really interesting. Let me see. Let me see. Whoa, whoa, he likes this one. You like that one, Cornelius? Oh, he likes the little feathery tail. Yeah, look at you. Oh, you like the little turtle again. I'm sure if I fill that thing up with treats, he'll love it even more. Oh, he's liking it. You like that one, Cornelius? It's helping with your little teething that's still going on. All right, let's give him a treat. Let's do a little soft chew first. So that one I think is little turkey. Choosies. Little choosies. So these ones are supposed to be soft. Do they feel soft, babe? Yeah, they feel soft. All right, corn. All right, sit. Turn. Good. Good boy, Good Cornelius. Good job, Cornelius. What, what do we this? think? It's turkey. Turducky. Turduckin? <laughs> Turducky. Turducky, huh? Five calories per tree. All right, sit. Speak. 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 Good, Good boy, job. Good job, Cornelius. So he, it seems like he likes these. Yep. Because he's eating it. He likes turducky. Turducky. Okay, All next right. are these fish ones. Oh, he's excited for these. Sit. Look at him. Come on, Cornelius. Be a good boy. Just break off a half. Sit. Dad's going to give you a half. Churro style. It's well, more like fish, though. Yeah, it's fish flavor. See, my husband would love the churro. But it's not a churro, babe. Okay, don't eat it. There. It's a fish one. He should love this because he loves anything seafood. And he likes the yaki sticks. He's always liked any of the ones I've gotten him. Made in the USA. Gluten free. Grain free. Cornelius, it's on the floor, baby. Lactose free. <laughs> Cornelius, are you not a fan? It's probably going to take him some time to like it, maybe. He loves yaki sticks, though, so he should like it. I think he's more hungry, and this is more of something that you kind of savor and just chew on. And he wants, like, food food. Get it. Yeah, Cornelius. Cornelius, come. This is kind of on the hard side. Thought it was going to be softer, but 
Feels kind of plasticky. This is how it looks though. <laughs> What's going on, Cornelius? Do you like it? I'll take him some time. I think um, the next video I do about pup box, I might do like a pup box empties or pup box favorites. So all the things that Cornelius has liked from past boxes, I may do a video on that coming up. Did you smell the shampoo, babe? I did. It this smells like lavender. Oh, nice. So that's going to be soothing for him. So it's like it's a lavender. 100% natural and bi biodegradable. Yep. And then puppy shampoo. The last thing that was in here were these... Uh, the poop bag so just looks like this it has a little clip that's in the shape of a bone so that's kind of cute and that's it so that is everything that we got for cornelius's april pup box i think he's gonna really like that elephant and we will see you guys in the next video say bye cornelius cornelius <laughs> he likes this one